Hello, in this session we will look at the delete command. Now at any point if you no longer want a workspace or if you want to delete any workspace then we can make use of this command terraform workspace delete and the name of the workspace that you want to delete and terraform will go ahead and delete that workspace for us. So this command will delete any existing workspace. So for example, let's say you know you want to delete this UAT ENV workspace or the dev ENV workspace, then you can make use of this command for that. So this is the syntax. So terraform workspace delete some options that you can pass, then the name of the workspace and then the optional directory name. And here is example command. So terraform workspace delete and UAT underscore ENV. And this will go ahead and delete that workspace for us. So this will delete the specified uh, workspace. Now to delete a workspace, the workspace should be existing. Uh, it must not be tracking any resources and it must not be your current workspace. So here for example, if you see, this is my current workspace and if I try deleting this, so Terraform workspace delete, uh, this will not work because this is my current workspace, this is my active workspace. So I'll have to move to a um, new workspace and then delete the old one. So let's say we'll switch to the UAT ENV. So let's select, uh, we'll do a select to the UAT. So now this will switch to the UAT uh, ENV. Sorry. So Terraform workspace list. So now I should be in the UAT ENV and now if I try run the delete command, this will delete the workspace for us. Okay, so that's one thing to keep in mind. The other thing to keep in mind is that the, the workspace should not be tracking any resources, meaning uh, it should uh, not have any state file, a valid state file or it should not have created any resources. So if you can remember, in the last session, we had created um, uh, our infra in this UAT ENV workspace. So here you can, if you can see in this uh, uh, state folder, I should have the state file, right? So any workspace which is tracking resources, you won't be able to delete it by default. So let's say uh, I'll go to the default workspace. Workspace select default so this will move to the default workspace okay so i am in my default workspace now right now if i try deleting this uat env workspace so let me clear the screen and let me just run this once again okay so let's try deleting this so terraform uh, workspace delete and i want to delete the uat env workspace this will also okay sorry i'm that's my active one so let me select the default one okay so i'm in me in my default workspace and now let's try deleting this and you see it says the workspace is not empty meaning it is tracking the resources for us and here are the resources that it is tracking okay so by default any workspace which is tracking the resources you won't be able to delete it but if the workspace is tracking resources terraform will not allow you to delete it unless you use this hyphen force flag so either you uh, destroy the resources so that it is no, no longer tracking any resources for us or you can forcefully delete it by making use of this hyphen force flag. So let's say uh, we'll go back to workspace select and here we will destroy the resources. Just waiting for this to destroy the resources. Okay, so this is complete. 
and now let's go back to our uh, default workspace and if I try deleting this uh, UAT ENV now this will go ahead and delete the workspace because it is no longer tracking any resources so that's one way which is a clean way of deleting your workspace but you have this another option which is using this hyphen force flag now if you delete a workspace which is tracking resources by using this hyphen force flag then the resources may become dangling all right so dangling basically are the resources that physically exist but terraform can no longer manage them now this is sometimes preferred you may want terraform to stop managing resources so that they can be managed by some other way most of the time however this is not intended and so terraform protects you from getting into this situation so uh, basically you know if you no longer want to manage the resources using terraform then you can make use of this hyphen force flag but you know uh, generally it is not recommended to use this to make sure your workspace is clean and you don't have any unmanaged resources or any dangling resources you destroy the resources and then delete your workspace so that's basically what your uh, delete command is that's all for this session thank you once again before you leave please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you like the video leave a like and please share the video